Hello everyone, I am a Champions Digivolve. We're back. I'm playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. So I've been doing some leveling up uh, and some deck building. And I'm very happy to say that my, uh, my deck has been... Welcome. My deck has been coming along very well. Very well. So I'm quite happy about this. And this game is getting me in the mood for opening some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So, look forward to that very soon. But, let's see. I've got some rewards to gain. Okay. Alright, we got our rewards. Let's go ahead and pick our cards. So, I'm using a very specific deck, and I've been working uh, very hard on obtaining the cards I need for said deck. So, let's exchange our tickets, because we get tickets for logging in. And I'm looking for specific cards. Now, the specific cards that I'm looking for, well, they're not exactly the most... Um, the most popular, to be honest. Gaia, Drake. No, I don't want Gaia. I don't want goblins. And then, okay, it leaves me with nothing. However, I do like this little guy here. So we're going to go ahead and take Gear Golem, the Moving Fortress. It allows me time to set up within my deck. So that is uh, very nice. Because it's going to take them at least a turn or two, usually, on average, to uh, gather up a monster that can destroy uh, 2,200 defense. So, Gaia, Gatekeeper, Gear Golem, oh, Gem Knight Pearl, and Gem Turtle. Okay. Flip, I can add a Gem Knight Fusion. Rock. Two level four monsters. The heck does that mean? I don't know what the Zixies is. I uh, never really got into that. I kind of want to grab it because look at that attack. And it's only stating that it's four star, but it says two level four monsters. So I'm assuming it's probably a tribute summon. So we're going to take Gem Turtle. We're going to take Gem Turtle. And I don't know. Everybody's probably screaming at me. What are you doing? Why am I in there? I don't want to be in the global chat. I hate the global chat. Uh, so, all a bunch of stupid advertisements. I don't like this crap. All right. So here's my deck. I'm still using Seto Kaiba. I haven't unlocked all of the duelists that are going to actually be useful for me. So, I need... Um, let's see. We're going to go by name. And let's see. All right, they're in here. So Gem Turtle's right there. And then we also have a gear right there. I'm going to add those two to my deck. So we're, we're currently running at about a 27-card deck at the moment. So we got, a couple, we got Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon. We got a couple Blue Eyes in the deck. Yes, I know. I have Blue Eyes in the deck. Um, we're running a stop defense. I'm keeping that in there just cause I, I mean, I don't really need that. That's, that's gonna, um, we're keeping the block attack and the block defense. Uh, this way it can buy me some time potentially, but for the most part, we're running on, you know, gem turtle, gem, gem knight, gem knight, gem knight. And then I'm relying heavily on my extra deck. So that is, that's going to be the important part. I don't have, and I will say this in the utmost certainty, I don't have all the pieces to my extra deck at all. 
So we need to go take this thing for a test drive. So I've been doing some ranked duels. And I currently have no PvP history. Sure. I mean, I do because, you know, I played against a, a whole bunch. Because I'm duelist. What? I think I'm level four. So we're up against the Yami Yugi. I'm playing against other people. I don't like going first. I really don't. All right. So what we're going to do. We're going to set. We're going to set. And we're going to set. So that's what we're going to do. So Iolite's got some pretty decent defense. He's got 2,000 defense at the current moment. So also... That Pyroxene Fusion is a trap card. If I run into a jam, he pulls a Dark Magician or something along those lines, I can activate that trap and pull a card that should be able to be uh, stronger than him. Hopefully. Maybe not, but Spellbook. No, we're not gonna we're not gonna do that yet. We're not showing our hand yet. What does that do? Look at the top three cards of your deck. I'm gonna turn them in any order. Okay. All right. I summon a monster in attack you position. summon a monster in attack position. How did you summon Gaia? Versus summon one. Activate the effect, <clears throat> and we're gonna pull out uh, Zirconia. I'll play this. I fusion summon a monster. <laughs> so Zirconia's got 2,900 attack. So go ahead and attack me, dude. I still got gem enhancement here. Yeah, your turn is done. Turn. See? Draw. So we got Tourmaline here, too. So we're going to go ahead and summon this one. I summon a monster now, I have this card, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to enter the battle phase. We're going to attack the Gaia. My monster attacks. We're not going to use that yet. So we're going to destroy the Gaia. We're going to attack him directly. That should drop him down to, what, 1,800? Not yet. My cards will not fail me. My cards won't fail me. Do I want... Now, what What do I have in the graveyard? I think I only have Iolite. And that's that's not... So we're going we're gonna to hold on to our gem enhancement for right now. For just right now, just this moment. <clears throat> I still believe in my cards. I draw. Heart of the cards. You already stacked your deck, so I'm thinking Black Luster Ritual is going to be in there somewhere. No. Come on, bro. This this deck is solely based on luck. So if I do not have the luck, I will lose the the duel. Right now we pulled a we pulled a great hand right off the bat, which is surprising. Um, person's gonna run out of service here, as you can see. They're going to wind up dropping out. A lot of times people will rage quit this game because they they didn't pull the hands that they wanted or, or whatever the case may be. So I win. So it says the person timed out. That could be the person closed the app on their phone. Uh, a, a number of different things. But this, this deck can tend to make people rage quit. And 
So we're rookie rank two. So we ranked up. We got four wins under our belt. So let's go ahead. We're going to do another one. So as you guys can see, my Gemini deck is it's it's set up in a way. Now, I don't have all the cards that I want. I'm missing a number of monsters. And I'm missing a few more like Pyroxene Fusions and, and other other cards that are very, very important to the guy. He going first! My my deck is is really based on going second. But as you can see, two gear golems. That's great. That is actually really good. So we're gonna go ahead and set Pyroxene Fusion down. And then we're gonna set this. Now I have the blue eyes white dragons with along with the blue eyes alternative white dragon because if i show this card i could special summon a blue eyes to the field without having to tribute but if i can get both of these down i can tribute summon this guy so there's there is a method to the madness okay who's he got red eyes wyvern and target one red eyes monster in your graveyard. Special summon that target. Okay. Hit me! Hit me with the best shot! Dun dun dun. Hit me with the best shot! Yeah, fire away! You got nothing. Yeah, you, you weren't expecting that. This is why I tend to, to make sure that I have cards with high defense. Now. That. That does stink. So I'm gonna go ahead and activate the banner, but that this is bad because I pulled that card. I oh what a mistake! Whatever. Continuous trap card. What does that one do? An opponent is special summoned to you. A monster you can control a face-up ninja monster. Have the attack of that special summon monster. What? Dark, the magician of dark illusion. Who's dark magician when it's on the field? To activate, except during the damage, uh, special summon this card from your hand. Ah, you pest! You're a pest. All right, I'm going to go ahead and set that. And then if we can get through this turn, we'll get a blue eyes out in the field. I doubt we will. So like I said, this, this deck is solely based on luck. And a lot of times I have a tendency of overloading my deck with too many cards. Generally, the card decks are 30, 30 cards. Um, enemy controller, huh? Why? Oh, you're going to swap me! Ugh. Okay. Fine. Fine. We're okay. We're still alright. We got this mammoth beast here. That's fine. We're still in it. He only took out a, a thousand life points. We are still in this. He can go ahead and attack me, and he'll lose 100 attack uh, life points. So go ahead. Yeah. I just realized we're fighting Aaron Yeager as Seto Kaiba. All right. I got Gem Knight Lapis. So I can pull Gem Knight Lapis. Uh, I can't. I'm not going to be able to. Another Gem Knight monster. Thunder type. Gem Knight one rock type. This one's a machine. All right. That, uh, that stinks. All right. I'm going to... I'm gonna have to go ahead and set it just to just to make the guy question what he's doing. Guy, gal, whoever it is, I'm gonna make them question their decision making uh, and see if they might be able to pull something stronger. Now he can tribute. She, he, they can tribute. 
They've got two cards. They would be able to tribute summon a blue eyes if they had one. Blue medicine. Okay. Seriously? That seems like a wasted space on your deck, but all right. You'll see how much stronger I am than you. Go ahead and attack that card. Go ahead. That's fine. That's fine. We're not worried about it. We're not. Heart of the cards. I'm going to need it. Um, okay. Tribute one Gem Knight monster, then target one Gem Knight monster. Crap. Okay, then. Well, that doesn't work. So, that's what I'm saying. Very, very, very luck-based deck. Now, I was doing great. I'm 5-0. and oh. And then I started recording. From my hand, I activate a spell. Okay. Congratulations. You're wasting time. You have nothing for me. Your deck is based on luck, too, and you were hoping they'd get this guy early. My turn. I know. Ah! I, I got nothing. I can't. I'm not going to place a gem enhancement yet. It's not going to do anything for me. I draw. But the more turns that I um, put off, the chances of them pulling a better card than me and with a higher attack than 2200 become greater and greater by the moment. There it is. Oh. Oh. I end my turn. Why? Oh, that sucks. I'm ending my turn. They could pull a god card. They could pull Exodia for all I know. Ooh, he put something. All right. Face down trap card. Let's battle. Go for it. <laughs> so this is kind of where these cards then then bite me in the behind. I got I I'm not pulling anything. So if I can't What a mistake! Ooh. Oh. Alright. He's gonna at least knock out 2,000 more of my life points. Well, until S.C. summons another monster. And then I lose! But it doesn't look like he's gonna. Let's battle. Okay. I'll blow you away. My monster attacks. The only way I can win this is if I pull Blue Eyes uh, White Alternative Dragon. I don't have an, I don't have any Gem Knights in my my hand. That sucks. That sucks. That's a shame. I gotta. It looks like I gotta cut out some um, some cards out of my deck. And I pulled a Pyrox Infusion. Yeah, I had to end my turn. You win, my friend. You win. I got eaten by a uh, titan. You can't hide from me, yeah. I draw. Let's battle. Well, we lost. Um, gonna go back, edit the deck. I'm gonna get rid of the stop defense. I'm gonna get rid of the stop attack. Um, I'm gonna cut out a few cards out of the deck. So it's all about finding that balance. But I lost. We're still a rookie rank two. Uh, if I lose again, then I will be at. Uh, I'll go back down to rookie rank one. So we're gonna ditch this card, this card. I've got kunai with chain. 
I like the two to one there. The, the reason I have alpha here is because it's a rock. It's a rock type. And a lot of these, so like, Zircone takes a rock type monster. Um, this one takes a thunder type, which is uh, Tourmaline. Master Diamond is three Gem Knights, and Brilliant Diamond is three Gem Knights. So, let's go ahead and do that. We cut out two cards out of our deck. I'll probably get rid of Banner of Courage as well. Uh, but we're playing after, like, this is the second time I've played. I've played it for all of, like, I don't know, I want to say about two and a half hours total. So, we're refining our deck right now. I gotta build up my gems so I can, uh... I can, yes, I'm going second. Thank you! So I can buy some more card packs so I can you know, potentially pull the uh, the Gem Knight cards that I really do need. So we got Gem Turtle, we got Tourmaline, and we got Alpha. So this is very, very good, because I believe Gem Turtle, if I recall, equates to a um, Gem Knight. I'm not sure. It might just be a Rock card, which is fine. Either way, I can pull um, Zirconia if I need to. And I can get Gem Knight Fusion if this is Flip Summon. Okay, then. What did he just do? He banished. To pull World Legacy, Guard Dragon, Mard... Oh, boy. Made in the blue. Oh, see, these decks are such a pain to deal with. So I pulled a Gem Knight Fusion. Um, the lovely part about... A lot of these cards is I could pull monsters from my hand or my side of the field so I can actually summon right now so I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna set gem turtle okay and I'm gonna show this guy what's up because I just need to make sure that I don't I'm not messing around too much so we're gonna pull that one and we're gonna pull alpha and we're going to put him in attack mode. Attack position. Whatever. Alright. So there he goes. Gem Knight Zirconia. Looking like a beast. Wait. Why was his attack cut? Is it this one? There's two cards... All monsters your opponent controls lose 500 for each dragon type monster you control. I don't. Oh, for they control! Crap. Well, that sucks. Alright, that's fine. We're gonna take this one out. We're gonna knock out 2400 of his life points straight off the bat. Wait. Why did I end my turn? Oh, bad play, misclick. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. That sucks so much. Oh, that's baloney. Oh, that sucks. Um, the only good thing is is that I'll be able to pull that monster back out of the graveyard, uh, I believe, with gem enhancement. Oh, I pulled Lapis. Um... I can go ahead. I'll lose 1,400, but I'll knock 1,200 life points off of them. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and set. I end my turn. My turn. If I can pull um, Brilliant Diamond, I'll be able to knock out anything that they've got without a problem. All right, dropping that into defense mode. Let's battle! Uh, not that one! Not that one! Oh, crap. Ah! So the blue eyes have come to get me. Alright, we're gonna end my turn. I can't do anything. 
He's got three monsters on the field, so if he doesn't pull anything, the tribute summon, he's stuck with those three monsters. However, he's going to change this one probably back into attack position. Oh, that's right, and I'll lose 500 attack points. So this one would only do 700 damage. So that's not good. Emerge! Dragon of... Ah, crap. Dragon Spirit of the White. Get I attack. Oh, that's fun. Yep, and attack me directly. So unless... Oh, now he's got two dragons. I lose a thousand. I... I lose. I lose. I'm sorry. I surrender. I surrender. Oh, I have to surrender. Mm. That sucks. That's ah, two losses. I got. I need the rest of the cards for my deck. Um, I'm really lacking on the Gem Knights and the Fusion cards. Because I really don't want to have the Blue Eyes White Dragons in my deck, period. Which, let's go ahead uh, for now... I'm going to ditch them. So we're going to go ahead and run it like that. And see if that makes um, any bit of a difference. But I think this is going to be my last duel. Because that's two losses now. That's not cool. Let's start the du 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 duel. Uh, not only is... Uh, the the deck itself important, but it's also the character I'm playing with. I'm not playing with the right. Ooh, I got a nice, nice draw, nice draw, nice draw. Okay, and we're going second. What? But three gem knights right off the rip, and a fusion. So I can actually potentially pull. Um, Brilliant Diamond uh, right now. Which is crazy. Okay. What do I got? I got Gem Enhancement. So, Tribute 1 Gem Knight Monster, then Target 1 Gem Knight Monster in your Graveyard. Special Summon that target from the Graveyard. Alright. So, I can tribute this card. Okay, we're going to summon Alexandrite, okay? And then, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and activate this. Um, and we are going to take... So I can do Prismora, and I can do Zirconia. Prismora, I could send one Gemini card to the graveyard to target one face-up card on the field to destroy that target. I'm not going to do that, though. I can also pull, like I said, I could pull Lady Brilliant Diamond, and I could pull Master Diamond. Master Diamond gains 100 attack for every gem monster in my graveyard. So that would put three, so it would gain 300 attack at a 3,200. Um, this one has the ability to special summon, which I'm not pulling either one of them yet. So I'm going to go ahead and pull Zirconia. And the reason being is I'm... No. One Gem Knight and one Rock type. Oh, neither one of them are Rock type. I'm a dummy. All right, so we're going to go ahead and pull Prismora instead. Not the card I wanted, but that's fine. Um, so we're going to go ahead. We're going to swap into the battle phase. I'm going to attack. All right, they take no damage. That's fine. Scared. 
and then we're gonna go ahead and end our turn. The Amazonas deck. Amazonas monster attacks, a monster with higher attack gains a thousand. Okay, so it's gonna attack him! That's fine. I'm gonna lose 50. That's fine. That's fine. I end my turn. It's clearly obvious that my strategy. I draw. So I'm going to head and set that. I'm going to go ahead and summon Lapis. I summon a monster in attack position. Now, I'm going to go into battle phase, okay? So we're going to go ahead. We're going to attack because I think that it's not going to gain that unless it attacks me. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead. We're going to attack directly. Then what I'm going to do, because he's going to be left with 50 life points, well, I'm going to be a jerk about things. Why? Why? I'm not scared. Normally I can... In Why can't I activate that? It's my turn. Come on. I draw. Normally I can activate gem enhancement. This one's going to have 2,400 attack. This card is on the field. Target one spell trap the opponent. Activate it. We're going to do that. We're going to pull that. Go ahead, dude. So that's the wonderful thing about gem enhancement. So now it can definitely go ahead and they, they can attack me. Oh, they, they didn't. Hmm. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to summon Garnet. I like getting gar uh, having a full amount of Garnets on the field, but he's got a trap card. Which is why it's taking so long, because I triggered it. Check out my face down card. My continuous trap activates. That's fine. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and attack this one. Should be game over. Despite getting the um the boost. Well, we won. So that's basically uh, a rough idea of how the Gem Knight deck works. Um, or at least how I run the Gem Knight deck. I think it's a lot of fun. And it's a trolly, like, people hate this deck because I could just steal turns from everybody. Uh, I can now use Restart, which I don't know what that is. But we ranked up. So we're, we're rookie rank three. But I think I'm going to wrap it up here. If you guys liked the video, please hit that thumbs up button. Do not forget to comment down below and subscribe to the channel. But you guys go out there and be my champions. And never click on any of this crap. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.